So I'm guessing you've already seen our Mini Cooper JCW review. If you haven't, click right here. If you have, well, then this is the second time we've got it. And I thought I'd do something different for this video. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to film a vlog and I'm going to take it to all the nice places in Pune that we think are quite understated. So we're going to take it out, eat some nice food and have some fun with it. And I'm going to show you some quirky little features of the car. Let's go. So the boys started to load up inside the Mini and as you can see, Soham somehow squeezed his way into the back seat and finally, we were off to our breakfast location. so obnoxious if I owned this ad. I'd rev the out of it everywhere. Have I told the people where, I, where we're going? So we are on our way to Vohuman Cafe which is a very 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 old school place in Pune that uh, has been there for quite a while and it's super famous like celebrities go there for breakfast and stuff. So it's nothing fancy. It's um, I don't know it's just like Parsi food and a little bit of <laughs> it's really tasty, nice and cheap place. You got like omelettes and breakfast stuff basically. It's quite nice. So we found some parking for the Mini which was kind of not too hard because the Mini at least in today's world is still quite Mini and headed off to Vohuman Cafe. Human speciality is eggs, breakfast, like toast. And so I've been coming here since 10th grade. After 10th grade, I joined Wadia College, and Wadia College is literally the next, uh, the next building across. So I always had my breakfast over here, which is, and I've always like developed liking the food over here. I don't know if it's actually nice or not. I just like it because I've had to eat it. So, let's see what the boys say. We didn't order anything wild. Just some simple breakfast menu items like a cheese omelette, butter toast and some chai. But boy oh boy was it absolutely delicious and insanely heavy. This whole meal for one person would set you back only 130 rupees. Quite a lot of food for not a lot of money. So we just got done with breakfast. It was amazing. We had uh, all of us had the same thing. It was a single egg cheese omelette and a couple of toasts with some chai. Quite simple but amazingly just filling and satisfying. Once we left back for home, I started to appreciate how good the Mini was as a city car and how bad it was at the same time. The suspension, the low profile tires and 18 inch rims are just way too stiff of a setup for a pimply Indian road but the interior more than makes up for it. The seats are very comfy, look amazing and hold you in place when you pin it around the corner. Mini has updated the center console to a bigger screen with better graphics and thank god they have kept the scroller wheel. Although it is quite rear set and because of that the infotainment can be quite difficult to use while driving. The instrument cluster has changed with a digital screen in the middle and some serious cost cutting bits on the side. If you think those are digital tax and screens, they are not and the matte finish doesn't help in terms of visibility. But overall, I love the quirky and funky cabin. It was very roomy and airy inside with surprisingly a decent amount of space in the back as well. That is if you can squeeze in. And more importantly, it always keeps you entertained with its funky features. Okay, so we are on our way to Between Your Buns. It's a burger joint here in Vimanagar, originally from a place which was I think NIBM and uh, now they have a new joint out here in Vimanagar and 
apparently they have really great burgers this is the first time i'm going to go check it out and i'm quite excited because all of us all of us at tdh love burgers so everyone is super excited um uh, apart from that experience with the mini has been great i love how attention seeking it is and how flashy it is everywhere is just eyes looking at me and i kind of like that uh if it's uh just the little noise that you do that the car makes while passing by when it's in sport it sounds great this 2 liter turbo is a proper rocket it has it has around 230 bhp and it is really nice so all the power is delivered throughout and it feels really nice when you actually catch grip you have really 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 thin tires which uh, sometimes take quite a lot of time to catch heat so if you are just like parked out somewhere and the day is quite cold and then you just decide to rip it away from your friends you will not catch grip on full throttle and the car will just start talk steering and it is quite a riot but if you feel like having some fun this is ever ready it's it's a lot of fun i really like it it's like a little puppy ready to do anything and if you just switch it to green mode all of it, it goes out the window and it's quite a lethargic uh, car but that's good for the city and it's really good for the mileage okay so we have just given our order in all of us are having burgers surprise surprise and uh, i'm having a cheese mutton burger soham's having a piri piri chicken burger and uh, tana is having a sriracha chicken burger all of them are meals so they'll come with some coke and some fries After stuffing our stomachs to limits we never knew, it was time to head back home and go into a food coma until dinner time. The mini stiff suspension wasn't helping our condition either by jostling our stomachs like a football. Many hours later. Okay, so we are pretty stuffed with food but last spot of the day quite a legendary spot quite a new spot and uh, something that we really enjoy amongst us young people it's a place with good portions uh small prices and really good food it's called pimliko it's in koreyao park and uh, we are almost there Just ordered. We, I've ordered myself a chicken cannelloni. Tanay has ordered himself a chicken primavera spaghetti. Uh, Kriti has ordered herself chicken parmigiano, which is the chef's special. And uh, the boring Soham ordered himself a spaghetti bolognese because he has literally no orig originality, and I have no vocabulary.
so we are just done with dinner it was great we had a lot of italian food and uh, it was all a modern rendition of classic italian food which was great and coming to the mini this feels like the home ground of the mini yes it is a jcw but bear in mind that the mini cooper starts at 38 lakhs and before it being a small city car or before it being a performance car i would say the mini cooper be it jcw or not it is a fashion accessory and there's nothing wrong in that going up parks north main road with these fancy hotels feels exactly like its home ground all in all this new mini cooper is a very versatile little car one day it can be a fashion statement on a fancy street in your city one day it can take you to work and on the weekend it can be your hoon machine in the mountains thank you so much for watching my name is bhavneet vaswani i'll see you in the next one mcrae on the inside going to take it and senna sprints away senna is